Now in this problem, what do we have to do is, uh, we have been given this, that this, but this expression is AM, that is arithmetic mean between A and B. So we have to find the value of M. Now what do we know about arithmetic mean? If you have two numbers, A and B, then arithmetic mean of A and B is A plus B divided by 2, sum, half of the sum. So that means this as per the question is equal to a to the power n plus b to the power n divided by a to the power n minus 1 plus b to the power n minus 1. So now we will simplify this and from this we have to find the value of n. So let's see how to do that. Now it's only algebra left. That is you have to solve this and simplify this and find the value of n. So this means that a plus b uh, into if we cross multiply a to the power n minus 1 plus b to the power n minus 1 is equals to a to the power n plus b to the power n into 2. Okay. So now if you open the brackets, if you expand it, you will get a to the power n if you multiply the first terms then a into b to the power n minus 1 and uh, then you will have plus b into a to the power n minus 1 plus b to the power n. Now this is equal to 2 into a to the power n plus 2 into b to the power n. Done. So now if you move these a to the power n, b to the power n to the left, to the right hand side, then you will get a into b to the power n minus 1 plus b into a to the power n minus 1 is equals to a to the power n plus b to the power n. Remember, what do we have to find? We have to find n. So, keep that in your mind as well. Okay. Now, what if I take this because, uh, sorry, here, a to the power n. So, if I combine these uh, a to the power n and a to the power n minus 1 on one side, right, not this, and b to the power n minus 1 and b to the power n on the other side. So, a into b to the power n minus 1 minus b to the power n is equal to a to the power n minus b into a to the power n minus 1. Done. Okay. Now on the left hand side, I can take b to the power n minus 1 common. So what will I have here is a minus b. And on the right hand side, I will take a to the power n minus 1 common. And then what will I have? The other factor will be again a minus b. So that means what? This means that this b to the power n minus 1 is equals to a to the power n minus 1. Or this means that b by a whole to the power n minus 1 is equal to 1 or this means that n minus 1 is equals to 0 which finally means that n is equals to 1. So this is the answer we were looking for. Okay, So the value of n is equal to 1. 